Oh look, there's actually a door behind here. In which we need a key. And we wouldn't have been able to do that without the hammer. So it's not like you could get the key, that first key and then accidentally go in that key in, blah, in that door and be screwed. You have to do the whole rest of the dungeon and get the hammer first. Die, Slugma! Bitches! Oh, well, did I hit this one? Oh, you can actually flip him over the Megaton Hammer and do, just deal with they asses like that. Is there a gold sculpture in here? I don't hear one. I think it's supposed to be in another one of those tile rooms, like this one. In fact, there it is. I'm just gonna run into him. Make it quicker. Ow. Actually, doesn't make it quicker at all, apparently. Oh well. Unless, except for the last one. Did I just see something fly by my head? Like, in real life? Not in this game. Because the only thing left in this room is a like like and a gold sculptula. Speaking of which, I've been like getting random bug bites on my body like a lot recently, like several times, like every day, like 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 <laughs> like like that's funny because I just killed a like like. Anyway, is there like some mysterious bug in here? It's not that I'm itchy, I mean, it's like, I mean, I am itchy, but it's not just random itchiness, it's like actual bug bites. I get like several of them every day, and that's not normal. That shouldn't happen. It should be a rare occurrence. There's a, a bug that's trying to assassinate me. He doesn't want me to beat the fire temple. For there is an untold secret that must remain secret. What is he stuck? Do a jump attack to do a little extra damage. Since jump attacks do twice as much damage, I believe. I'm blue, double D, double D, and double D, and double D, I fucked it up. Those aren't even words, and I can't get them right. Alright, just run away. Run like a bitch! Do to do. What are you on the other side? Oh, actually, I think I might as well just go ahead and show what he does. Looks kind of cool. That's his attack. So I like how you like pull his pull him out of that body and it, the body just keeps going and then just like vanishes. I was trying to see if the explosion actually did damage. I guess it doesn't. Or maybe it's just like it does damage, but there's still like the smoke spreading. I don't know. But what's in here? It's uh bombs. A bombs. Okay, so I came in that door because it's the red arrow, so I'm supposed to go in here. And there we go. Why did I unequip the... Way to go. We are nearly done here. Let's go get this boss key and go fight the boss. Let's see what you have to say first. Oh, I didn't know I could actually skip that dialogue. Now I feel bad. Oh well. I'm sure it wasn't very important anyway. I wonder what could be in here! Oh, it's a boss key. I didn't see that one coming. What's through this side? I don't remember. Oh wait, yeah. Yeah, I remember. I remembered at the very last second. I think you could actually go in there from the very beginning, but... So it's like you'd go in there and you'd see the boss 
key chest and be like, whoa, it's right there, but how, you, you, you couldn't get to it. It would just be taunting you the whole dungeon. Like, the boss key chest was right there. Why couldn't I get it? Why? Now I wish I left those fairies there so I could go over and get them. Just to heal up these three hearts. Well, two and three quarter hearts. Because now it's going to slightly bug me, but let's go deal with the boss. This is a cool battlefield. Or should I say a hot battlefield? <laughs> that glowing red effect doesn't work quite as well when my tunic is already red. So it's like red that's glowing red. It's like redception. Oh, what's going on? Subterranean Lava Dragon, Volvega. Actually, I guess it's Volvagia, Volvagia, Volvagia. I don't know how to pronounce it. I always called it Volvega, so I'm just going to call it Volvega. Even though there's an IA, so that would denote that I am almost definitely wrong in my pronunciation, but I don't care. Rah! I'm a dragon! Ow! Why'd you hit me in the head? Jack? I don't know. I always pictured Val Valvega. Just, 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 just scream. I'm calling it Valvega. I don't care. This is my LP. I can call it whatever the fuck I want. Bitch. But I always pictured Valvega as being a female dragon. I don't know. Maybe it's the hair. Not so much that it's long. It just looks kind of like a feminine hair hairstyle. So, especially when it does this. Just like, ain't nothing but a hair flap! Holy crap! I'm low on health. Where are you gonna appear? It's okay, I've got... I got fairies. No, you stoop! Wrong C button. <laughs> Flying high into the sky. I never actually realized this until I actually looked up, but it's just flying around up there. I just assumed that it disappeared. And just rocks started falling, but no. She be flying around up there. Again, just presuming it's a she. Alright, stop. Stop. Screwing around. I'll kill you. I did that in Super Smash Brothers Brawl. I guess that's like my dragon voice or something. Except I can't do it very well right now since my throat hurts. Ring! A quarter of a heart! Let's see if I can do it. <laughs> no! No! I got dead. Isn't that the first time I've died in the whole LP? And is that gonna count towards my death count since I had a fairy? I don't know, but I guess I'll find out. Can't see. I'm gonna shoot you in the face. Because that apparently does damage. Oh man, well I'm out of arrows now. Don't play me for a fool like that. You tricked me. You made me think you were gonna show up there, but then you didn't. You showed up elsewhere. Well played. Oh, don't do that again. Oh, wait, no. It's just... Where? Wait, is it? Crap. Ouch. Oh, how did that miss? It's not really like there's a real reason to be running around, because I'm pretty sure the rocks don't really have any sort of aim. It's just kind of they're just randomly falling everywhere. This one should just about do it. Ouch. Man, that fire does a lot of damage. Oh, man. Dude. Oh, come on. Ooh. Get the way, 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 get the way. 
I'm chasing my tail. Ah! One heart. One heart remains. This battle is going on way longer than it should. This is, this is officially the longest I've ever done this battle, I think. It's because I keep screwing it up. Oh, wow. That looked like I messed that up. Ah, no! I'm melting! I'm melting! Oh, what a word! What a word! Who would have thought a little Hylian hero such as yourself could destroy my beautiful dragonliness? Oh, I'm a skeleton now! Yeah! I'm just a skull. Don't mind me. Ah, oh, I burst into flames and disappear. Now I'm nothing. I'm nothing. Nothing. Maybe I should remember the heart container this time. Wait, 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 wait. Am I sure there's nothing left here? I think so. Let's get out of here then. This is one of my favorite dungeons. I guess, I guess this would probably be my second favorite dungeon in the game. I didn't even mention that. Well, maybe I like the forest temple a little more. My favorite is yet to come. He's like, whoa! Imagine seeing that in real life, like not with N64 graphics, just imagine what something like that, that kind of phenomena, what, what that would look like in real life. That would be, in, that would be amazing to witness. Oh boy, he's the sage who would have thunk. Thank you, brother. I really appreciate what you did. I thank you on behalf of the entire Goron race. By the way, he looks kind of high right now. Look at his eyes. You turn out to be a real man, just as I thought you would. Man, whoa. By the way, I, the wild Darunia, turn out to be the great sage of fire. Isn't that funny, brother? There wasn't any other real candidates to be the Sage of Fire because I'm the only significant character that takes place in a fire area in this game. Guess that's what they call destiny. It's what I call semi-limited character design. Nothing has made me happier than helping you seal the evil something I didn't see. Hey, brother, take this. This is a medallion that contains the power of the fire spirits and my friendship. Friendship. Gotta love friendship. Do, 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 friendship. Let's show him the real superpower of teamwork. He adds his power to mine. Don't forget, now you and I are true brothers. Okay then. Now that that seems to be that, that is it for this episode. Tune in next time for more Let's Play Ocarina of Time. This is Fish114 on the map penis. Signing out.